This video will cover the engine compressor wash on the Citation Mustang. The compressor wash of the PW615 engine on the Citation Mustang is recommended to clean the engine of buildup not removed with a desalination rinse or for performance recovery. Refer to the Pratt & Whitney PW615F-A line maintenance manual section 71-00-00-16. The equipment required to complete the task is a tank system which can be procured from several sources. The compressor wash one, part number PWC69836. The fan blade wedges, part number PWC66581. And a method to prevent water intrusion into the oil tank during the process. This can be done by disconnecting the breather tube or using a blanking plug, part number PWC69812. The Pratt Wendy parts can be purchased through Pratt Wendy. Also, an approved detergent according to the line maintenance manual is required. Connect the wash wand to the tank system and adjust the settings until the flow rate is 1.6 US gallons per minute. This can be done by marking a bucket and timing how long it takes to reach the line. Install the fan blade wedges so that they are about 90 degrees apart. Ensure that the flat part of the wedge is facing the inlet abradable liner. Turn the fan into the wedges to help lock it in. Remove the breather tube or install the blanking plug at the breather port and exhaust in the engine. Ensure that it is seated solidly. Disconnect the two P3 bleed ports and bag the tubes, not the engine. Support the bleed tubes as necessary. Turn off the bleed air source select in the cockpit. Insert the compressor wash wand so that the tube is in the core and the plastic wedge is against the fan and spinner. Communicate with the person in the cockpit and have them engage the starter for that engine. As it starts to spool, open the valve at the wand and inject the cleaning solution. The person in the cockpit needs to push the starter disengage button after 20 seconds. As the engine is winding down through approximately 5% N2, shut off the flow of water at the compressor wash wand. Allow the cleaning solution to sit for 30 minutes. Communicate with the person in the cockpit and have them engage the starter for that engine. As it starts to spool, open the valve at the one and inject the rinse water. The person in the cockpit needs to push the starter disengage button after 20 seconds. As the engine is winding down through approximately 5% in two, shut off the flow of water at the compressor wash one. If cleaning solution remains, then repeat this step again for 20 seconds. Remove the blanking plug or reinstall the breather tube. Remove the fan blade wedges. Verify that the oil sight glass does not show any signs of being fuller than before or discolored. Reconnect the two P3 ports after removing the bags. Complete these steps on the other engine. Perform a normal engine start on both engines and operate for one minute at 80% N1 to dry them out. Ensure that there are no bleed leaks. Operate at idle for five minutes with the bleed air source off. Shut down the engines. If there are any questions or concerns regarding the compressor wash of the PW615 engine, please contact T Mustang at 316-517-5490 or by email at tmustang at cessna.com.